It is important to reflect on each lesson taught as it aids one in understanding how learners learn best and will assist in identifying methods or manners in which learners can progress. With regards to the reflections made on my teaching experience, I observed how different teaching strategies impacted or affected learners. For example, from my lesson reflections, I identified how long a time period should be set aside during each lesson phase for classroom discussions. During classroom discussions, learners enjoy expressing their experiences and become intrigued in listening to their peers' perspectives on the topic. In terms of the noise level in the classroom when learners are being taught, I would implement classroom management tools such as clapping twice to indicate to the learners that silence is needed in order for the lesson to progress. This management tool will aid in enforcing listening skills amongst the learners and will keep the learners focused on the task at hand. Through the lessons I taught, I observed how learners could lose concentration easily on activities when they were not differentiated. Therefore, it is important to have a variety of activities throughout a lesson that range from using concrete objects to then using semi-concrete objects to then using abstract conceptualization. For example, for a mathematics lesson I taught on halving, I incorporated using mathematical counters to then using number charts to then using scrap paper to determine the answers to halving sums by dividing by two to incorporate differentiation. Ultimately, lesson reflections aid in improving teaching techniques and it improves one's skills.